Hello guys, what is up? I am Lee Epnep 121 welcome to episode 5 of the Pokemon Heart Gold Middle Life Edition. The run in which I try not to kill a single wild Pokemon. Well, at least that's the plan. Last time, we made our way to Goldenrod City. Off screen, I mostly just, well, grinded for um, card points to get myself closer to the rank candy, which I found I actually only could get one of. Which is a bummer, but oh well. Anything to help out the cause. In this episode, I get my lottery ticket uh, checked. We're gonna he finish up Goldenrod and hopefully the third gym. And we'll see if, um... We'll see if uh, we get some uh, interesting stuff happening. You know what I mean? And, uh... Oh yeah, join me on Colcom. My good friend Seltus Knight, my Soul Link partner. Hello! He's actually grinding on the Soul Link. Well, he's um, seeing me... Possibly jousting myself with a milk tank for the next 30 minutes or an hour. We'll see. <laughs> we'll have to find out. But anyways, well, that's if, gonna be fun. if you guys are hyped for more Heart Gold on the channel, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe for content if you're new, and ring that bell to get notified and top on the channel. Last episode on the card up here. Anyways, a uh, quick recap. I didn't do anything else. Uh, to my team. So Lulhax, the Togepi, is still level 16. Kanya, the Kolaba, is still level 20 at their respective uh, stats. All oh, that's really sad to say. Alright. Without further ado, let's get started. So here's the thing. I actually did not battle the trainers below either. So Route 34, actually, the trainers have been untouched. Well, untouched no more. And again, for those wondering, this is a run in which I try not to kill a single wild Pokemon. So that means I can catch wild Pokemon, between the legendaries, I cannot kill them unless it's forced. Which, I don't think that actually is any of such Pokemon in the... Oh, sorry, in this game. Um, I think outside of... No, because that's all I made. Never mind. Yeah. I, I was thinking of the catching tutorial. Yeah. Oh wow, crit on the first one, okay. Ah, it's gonna disable my extra sensory though. Let's do some uh, metronome and see what we can get. I guess we can get a little bit of extra experience there. Hey, yo, you turn! I'll be honest, I'm dreading training up my, uh, <laughs> some of my Pokemon. I'll try not to uh, spoil for the, uh, people watching the stream. Hmm. Yeah, I remember but, that this uh, that remember that this episode is of so of the Heart Gold Run is literally right after that last one, if you know what I mean. Really? Yeah, so make sure you don't actually spoil it. Well that's nice. But regardless, uh some of these Pokemon are gonna be a pain to to grind up. Hmm. Okay, yeah, 63 embargo. Ooh, we're after it. You! Yeah, I'm gonna say you battle at night, so you don't actually battle me yet. I might have to do that one off screen. Actually, unless I do a nighttime session, which I'm not too sure if I will, but I'll have to check on my schedule. Ba -da -ba -da. Ba -da 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 -da. So, I'm imagining this is a really hard uh, run to actually do. Well, it doesn't help. Dog on it, Canter. Canter did a U, yes. Um, it doesn't help that um, I am trying to go for a team that does not uh, use a legendary. So basically, I'm not going to use the Ho or the Lugia. I mean, now last resort, yes, I'll probably use them if uh, my initial plan doesn't come up um, properly. But if I'm, I'm correct. Aren't those Pokemon required to get at some point in the game? In my game, Ho Oh, Lugia is um, optional at level 70. Well, that's what I'm saying. You don't require to at least encounter it. Well, Ho Oh, yes. Lugia, no. Yeah. So, if that's the case, you'd have to try and catch it. Yeah, that's the idea. Well, I mean, Ho-Oh I'll have to catch. 
Candor, this is a Pokemon Heart Gold run. It's a normal run, except the fact that I'm not allowed to kill a single wild Pokemon. I can catch them, I just cannot fake them. It's simple, he's making this really hard on himself. So I'm gonna have to hope- I'm gonna have to hope to utilize rare candies as much as I can. Oops. Honestly, I would much prefer doing a Nuzlocke than this shit. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought on the Simply, whim, I always just thought on the whim like, hey, this seems possible, let me try it. It is definitely possible, I don't recommend it. Question, can you find a Diglett or a Duck Shrill? I actually don't know where Diglets are in this game. Except, of course, the Diglett Cave, that's a duh answer. So we'll have to see. First shipment speed on your mono pros and run. Nice, Canter. For those wondering, Canter 002 is doing a Pokemon X mono bug run, poison run, excuse me. He he just finished a black black two white two mono bug type run. And no, uh, ladies and gentlemen, he and no, ladies and gentlemen, he's not trying to become a drive. I mean, in all fairness, I did a mono bug type team of, uh, what was it, uh, Gen 8. Oh yeah, you did mention to me about that. Yeah, it was very fun. I feel like those ones would not be that bad, because it's all just about just getting through the game. It's not like, it's not like you're on some sort of, like, very big restriction. Granted, no, I know, really. granted, I know excluding yourself to just one type is a big restriction, but it's not that bad of a restriction compared to, well, I, what I'm doing. Well, also, the other thing is that uh, it can make things more interesting. For example, when I was doing the uh, bug type, mono type in uh, Gen 8, you, the, the game I had, I ran into a rock type gym leader at the 6th gym. Oh boy, did that uh, cause a lot of problems. To oh. Say the least. I, I probably would suspect that, honestly, considering... Um, it was very interesting, because I also had some, like, bug, uh... Bug fire type, I had a bug what I you had to utilize two of my Pokémon, utilizing their secondary typing. Hmm. Like, I had to focus on, uh... Getting, uh... My uh, Excavalier and uh, I can't remember the water type I had. Raquinid, that's what it was. Mm. Um, I had to get Raquinid and uh, Excavalier to uh, beat the gym because otherwise I wasn't going to beat it with my other team members. I see. Oh, so it looks like Canter is heading over to Luminos for the Bulbasaur. Yeah, Bulbasaur is one of the like, earliest rock type. Or, uh, sorry. It's rock type! <laughs> Great job! Sorry, a graveler popped up on my screen. <laughs> oh. That will do it. Also, that will do it. Level 18 lol hacks. Yeah, but no, it's a, one of the earliest uh, poison types you can get access to. I, I think with those first... I think when those watching my run for those uh I should say, I did mention how this whole entire run of Pokemon Heart Gold is dedicated to one person in particular I watched for so many years. It will become, I think, way more obvious, I think, after this session. Not this episode, this session. So stay tuned for that. Yeah, I've, Weedle was the first poison type I think you can get in the entire game. Yep, it is. But still, Bulbasaur is one of the earliest ones you can get access to. Alright, I do know for a fact that there are trainers inside the underground that leads to, um... Whatever's in there, uh, the, the hairdresser thingy. Ah, oh, there we go. Hey, Lyra. When you follow this tunnel, you'll see a dress of Sha, where you Pokemon accessories. Here's the fashion case. Of course, I'm not really planning to use that. Special attack, well, uh, Canter.
Yeah, he's a special attacker. Grimer, Grimer. Don't tell me that Pokemon has... No, it doesn't. I know what that Pokemon has. Nice. Trying to figure out the abilities in this Nuzlocke has been insane. Grimer again. The one thing, thing about um, what's coming up though with Miltank is the fact that I have a lot of trainers in the gym I can battle, so that's gonna be a few levels. But more importantly, Lolhax has Charm, so if I were to whittle it down to just a Miltank, Charm is just gonna absolutely ruin uh, Miltank one way or another. Even now, I'm not, I'm not free from the self-destructs. <laughs> oh, for crying out loud. Still okay, get level 19 on, um... At least the mom lived. <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, that, that will help. <laughs> hey, look at Tom. Uh, let me actually send this that metronome. We'll see what crazy stuff we're doing. Um, uh, Kanta, he's... Kanta, he's, refer uh, he's right now, um, grinding for our Soul Link. And yes, yeah, Kanta, I, I know you have been wanting us to be able to Soul Link. I, I have a lot of stuff I need to do, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> Metronome into Aqua uh, Ring. I don't know how to feel about that. <laughs> dot 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 dot. You know, I'm just I'm just here for uh, kicks and giggles, I guess. Kicks and giggles. There's no particular reason. I why am axing this Lickitung so badly right now. Sardin78, hello, welcome to the, ch uh, the, the channel, welcome to the stream. How you doing? Hope you're having a fantastic day, I'm Joel, I'm Leopold one one I play video games. You're watching me doing a Pokemon Hardcore run where I don't kill a single wild Pokemon, aka minimal effort. It's all about just taking out the trainers and that's it. Or possibly some Antu cheesy stuff, possibly. You never know. I know he calls it minimal effort, but it's really maximum effort here. Because that's this is a really hard thing to actually do. That's true. I'm great. I have to call him to work tomorrow because I'm so behind in finals. Ooh. What year are you in, Sarnan? And, uh, and uh, all the best for those finals at the same time. Might, not might. That's not going to easily just take out, but uh, let me see if I can kill a lol hat. Senior in college? Yo! Ooh, that's rough. That is rough, but... Cause... You graduated in six days? Yo. All the best for your finals, my man, Sarnan. Good luck. I just got Barrier twice in a row through Metronome. That's a 1 in 100 chance. <laughs> Miracle Eye, not so that's gonna help. Sam's Club will help to wait. Oof. Yeah, that's understandable. Yeah, that's, that is understandable. I mean... Well, they're asking for it. Sam's Club, more like study club, you know what I mean? Anyways, um... But yeah, no, I mean, all the best way to study is... I mean, I've been through university and we also have finals as well. So I know the struggles you possibly are going through with all this studying. Daniel, all the best! Uh, it's been a while life. since I, I was in school at this point, but I understand. Uh, Do you ever feel weird about calling in even if it's for a good reason? Uh, nothing so wrong about calling in. Although, I'll be honest, I don't know what that means. I think, I think you're saying calling out. <laughs> I thought calling in is something on like you know that they do in college. That's why I I have no idea. The only thing I if if they're referring to uh, not going to work. Oh, like say you're not going to be at work tomorrow. Ah. Uh, and then you say that hey, I'm going to actually be at work. 
Is that the general gist? No, I think they're just calling work to let them know that they won't be there. Uh, I mean, if the reason is understandable, like sickness, then yeah. I don't usually want to call out at work. Like, I, I always want to at least make sure I can be at work every day to the best of my abilities. Oh no, no Celtus, I'm, I'm American. Celtus is American, I'm not. I'm 12 hours away from you, Sarnan. If you're American, that is. I've just, I've never heard of it as calling in, I've always heard it as calling out. Oh, Encore. Uh, you know. I'm gonna keep my own moves, I don't want to Encore yet. Charm is my gonna be area. my... Charm is gonna be the my main thing. My area's weird. Voltorb. But university studies are similar to college, except with some, I guess, more or less perks, I guess. Uh, university is very similar to college. It's just slightly different names depending upon the area. Nice miss, Voltorb. I mean, Night Matrix says the Malaysian. I mean. I'm like the only- I'm like the only, the only people you can have for a co-com because I'm a, I'm nocturnal. Nocturnal? I guess that's one way to describe it. Look, I- <laughs> Okay, good. At least I- did I, overnight, I did I, overnight for a long time. At least I did say the right one. I was worried that I mentioned the wrong one. And by wrong one, I mean the wrong, uh, nationality. Ah, uh, dead center. I'm southeast. Then center of the U.S. North Carolina? No. North Carolina, yes. North Carolina's not dead center. North Carolina's on the east coast. Wait? Wait, hang on. Where am I? No. No, I think it's North Carolina. I'm pretty sure. Also, I just- Oh, Missouri! North Carolina is on the coast, it's not dead center. Well, they said the geographic center of North America is North, De North uh, Carolina, I think, is it? Or am I no. getting my facts wrong? You're getting your facts wrong. Wait, there was- North, Car North Carolina is literally on the far east coast. Then what is the geographic center of America? Uh, you're looking at, like, literally the center of the Great Plains. The States gets a lot of hurricanes, oh yeah. Yeah, speaking of hurricanes, I finally got a new roof. Unless there's a Canadian that he knows in this fan group. Uh oh, wait. Riddles. I guess. I mean he's not Not actually not... Canadian, but No, he he's actually Canadian. I'm oh, sorry, no, but he doesn't live in Canada. Canada. Not Canada any... right now. Not anymore. Yeah, not anymore. Oh, Canada! Oh, Canada! <laughs> that, 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 that's why I actually said I. Every time I want to say Canada, I might actually say Canada because I'm thinking to myself, oh, just get rid of the N. Not the smartest move, though, to do that. Uh, you do your thing. Wait, actually, <laughs> hang on. Canada. Hang on, I think the... wait, is it? Is the service there? Broken uh, salon, over the two I can make a Pokemon beautiful just so the box. Yeah. The, how we know each other is pure dumb luck, basically. Um, we end up in uh, a Discord group called the CGGP. And that's where we met. But I end up only in that Discord by a string of events that I don't even know how I got there. I basically ended up part of a Twitch raid to someone else. Um, uh, I think it was... What happened to your screen? I mean, that's just the beauty of Park Gold on the emulator. Also, I just read your bio and watched our karma so much in the past. Ah, Sarden, yeah, that... Speaking of that... Maybe people consider me the young, the uh, descendant of Chugga Conroy. It's funny because uh, I never watched Chugga Conroy until I joined CGGP. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we've we've done it. Did you get a bicycle? Um, I forgot already. 
Yeah, so you do give me the bicycle. So, yeah, I ended up in a, in a Twitch raid to Tim, uh, Nintendo Capri Sun, which then resulted in me watching someone else by the name of Gamera Obscura. Which then resulted in me ending up in, watching someone else because I got introduced to their group. Which then that resulted in me meeting Yosh. He then introduced me to CGGP, where I then ran into Lee. Like I said, long convoluted story for me. <laughs> to be honest, though, I consider myself as well in the bed, uh, one of the coolest guys around here. I can just say that he can hang out with anyone. I mean, thank you. I, I mean it, honestly. I, I consider you the best friend. Aww. <laughs> Thanks. Honestly, level 20, I mean, personally right now that I'm just killing, like, um, battle Pokemon, the nice thing is that at least I get double experience, A. B, that makes it easier because I only have two Pokemon right now on the team. The Bell Sprout, for those wondering, is not being used. That's just my cutter. Alright, so shenanigans so far, getting Barrier twice by Metronome in a row. I haven't seen Chuck in so long that he's still making videos. Funny you ask that Sarnen, he is currently doing his Pokemon Black 2, White 2 playthrough right now. And I'll say this, he has a lot of people helping him out. Um... Also, doggone it, Patrick. To be fair though, he doesn't have flash yet. I don't think so. Huh. Oh, sorry. Hey, level 20. I'm wondering. I wouldn't mind actually if it's now. Uh, I still don't know how loud my keyboard is sometimes. Can you, how, how much can you hear my keyboard? Can't hear anything right now. I mean, I'm just wondering if it's normally picking up. <laughs> oh no, it does pick up, but it's not like, unbearable. Trust me, I've heard worse keyboards. I need to find some way of stopping my controller and keyboard from being picked up. I am 25, really be about to be 26 next year. I said next year, next <laughs> month, sorry. I saw. <laughs> I have 25, going to be 26 next month, Sarnen. I just looked up and saw a candy sample. You're also 25? Yo. Forever 25. I mean, I, sometimes I feel like that. Like, I, I'll be honest, Patrick, I look back at my previous, like, post of the pictures when I was, like, 23, 22. I haven't really changed much. I, I and, literally and my parents were sitting stuff. literally across the table probably can agree with me on that. I literally look the same since freshman year of high school. Wow. I, in fact, still have a shirt from my 8th grade So I'm year. also I old. I mean, we're all just all growing old together, Sarda, and that's the beauty of life. Boy, <laughs> <laughs> boy, only <laughs> guy. <laughs> uh, I watched another Singaporean. His expression is now looks twenty-one, but is thirty years old. Wow. Aurora beam. Okay. Uh, no. If you're wondering who Lee's talking with, it's I'm Celtus. Um. Uh oh. I've. I don't. <laughs> I don't know what else to say. I wouldn't mind. Ah, uh, was hoping. It's kind of hoping that that uh, signal beam actually flinched it. I oh, know, sorry, confused it. Wow, okay. Um. 
but to Are... answer your question as to how old I am, I am 23. I always love it when there's a disembodied voice lamau. <laughs> ah, the I'm, disembodied voice I'm which is Celtus. Yeah, strong angst you Pokemon. That's good to hear, my friend. Yeah. Still, yeah. Bit, still, still have quite a bit to live. Oh no. <laughs> Hmm, this feels like a low question. <laughs> low key. Ba -da 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 -da. <laughs> well then. Ah, uh, yours. <laughs> wow, the elder. <laughs> Lovely. Uh, you must have seen the elder scroll when it was made. But I'm Tish. Oh yeah, it's just triple Jigglypuff. Just why in the world not? Yeah, so respect your elders! I wonder if that was supposed to be 37 or 30 and you just fucked up. <laughs> that that would have been funny. Also, I don't wow, know. Flame Wheel, absolutely destroying. Um, it's funny because, uh, when I was in. <laughs> okay, Patrick. <laughs> Also, man, am I the second oldest among the four of us? And by four, I mean Selfless, me, Patrick, and the Canter. Huh. It's funny because, uh, when I was doing, uh, when I was in high school, I had a band director who was, like, he was, I think my, my junior year, he was 30. Mm. Um, but he, for the, like, every year since he was, uh, he started being a direct a band director, referred to himself as 30 because he was like two years older than the people he was teaching when he first started. Interesting. Um, so he just never told them his real age, and then he finally told us his real age my junior year. And he said every year he was 30 when everyone asked, and he said uh, when I was when I was in a junior um that, uh, he was actually 30 this time. Oh, no. So he did mess up. Or was it on purpose, the Zero Canter? He might have, he might have done it on purpose. <laughs> no, we can't there. 